In this video, let us see how Caliber VO can be used within Caliber Extraction Flow to back annotate parasitics into Cadence Virtuoso environment. Caliber VO is used to send the Caliber parasitic extracted information to Cadence design environment. The extracted view after Caliber VO is run looks like this. Let us see how we can do that. We have the design open in Cadence Virtuoso. We run Exact by clicking on Caliber and run Exact. We have the rules file. In the output, we choose Caliber view as the netlist format. Select ground to put the name of the ground net, otherwise the ground net will be named zero. It is also necessary to select C location and R location in order to have the parasitic capacitors and resistors in the correct location in Caliber view. Also, we need to make sure we have Generate ASCII cross-reference files enabled. For the parasitic elements to be displayed in their layout location, it will be necessary to turn reduction off and we run exact. Once the exact is run, we have the Caliber View setup window open. I choose mask layout for the Caliber View type and multiplicity factor is set to 1 in reset properties. Select layout locations for both the device and parasitic placements. Also, select show parasitic polygons to display the layout as an overlay on top of the caliber view and click OK. The caliber view is now created. It will have symbols of all the devices and parasitics. Now that the extracted view has been created, it can be used in simulation to verify if the layout with the parasitic effects still meets the design specifications. This is how we set up Caliber View in Cadence Design Environment. I hope you found the video useful. Thank you so much for watching.